Hello, I am Dr. Arla Gopalakrishna Gokhale. I am cardiothoracic and transplant surgeon working at Apollo Hospital, Jubilee Hills, Hyderabad. You know, these days, heart problems have become very common and there are a lot of treatment options available for the patients with the heart problems. Many of these patients can be managed in medicines and some regular surgeries like bypass surgeries, open heart surgeries like valve replacements. However, there are a few patients for whom the heart muscle is damaged a lot and the pumping capacity comes down. Normally, when the heart pumps blood, if it gets about 100 ml into the heart, it pumps about 60 to 70 ml. It's called ejection fraction. Sometimes when the heart muscle is damaged, maybe because of a heart attack, maybe related to viral infections called dilated cardiomyopathy or nutritional deficiency, whatever may be the reason, when the heart muscle gets damaged, it pumps only about 20% or 30% instead of 60 to 70%. Then these patients go into what is called heart failure. Heart becomes big, their uh, legs start swelling up, the, the moment they walk for a few feet, they start becoming breathless, they can't lie down flat. In those situations, many a time medicines will not be of much help. And we see if sometimes a special type of pacemaker can help these people. If it also is not going to help them, then they are left with only two options. One is heart transplantation, the other is insertion of a ventricular assist device. Of these, heart transplantation is a very proven modality of treatment. And when these people have got certain uh, indications like heart muscle pumping is very low, 20% or less, they are going to recurrent heart failure and their age is less than 65 to 70 years of age. And when other body systems are working like uh, liver is working well, brain is working well, kidneys are working well, in these situations, you give them this option of heart transplantation. And we do a few tests, make sure that these patients are fit for surgery, for transplantation, like we exclude the possibility of any antibodies so that they don't reject when we put in a new heart and the pressures in the lungs are fine. So we do a battery of tests. If those tests are favorable, then we keep them in the waiting list. A suitable donor with a similar blood group, similar body surface area, then if the relatives of the donor are willing to donate heart, we get the heart and replace the heart of this patient. And once we do the transplant, many of these patients do very well. When we select patients properly, the success rate is more than 80 to 85 percent. And many of these patients will live very long. The 10-year survival rate following transplants is more than 60 to 70 percent. We have many patients walking around even after five years, six years, seven years, taking care of their businesses, doing their jobs, leading a near normal life. So the potential of heart transplant is a person on a deathbed can get up and lead a near normal life for many years. a 36 years old man who was diagnosed to have dilated cardiomyopathy and with this he has been going to a recurrent heart failure and he was admitted in hospitals frequently many a times so we thought he will never come back and we tried to manage him medically and then when we spoke to the patient and the family about the heart transplant because there is no other option for the patient they agreed for the transplant we did the investigations kept him in the waiting list and fortunately we had a brain dead donor about 29 year old person, same group, and the family of the brain dead person were willing to donate the heart. So we brought the heart and replaced the heart for this patient. Now he got up from the bed, he is able to walk, eat food in about 24 hours after surgery, and he is going home 10 days after surgery, and his heart is working very well. He is almost normal, and we are expecting that he will do well over the long run. This is what a heart transplant can do for the people with the end stage heart disease. I am Naveen Kumar. I am from Hyderabad. Actually, I have an heart problem. It got revealed in May 2013. Afterwards, uh, I met uh, Dr. Gokhale and then he suggested me to plan for a heart transplantation. My heart transplantation was done and it took a good, it was a good experience and also it's a great the Google team had made it a great success which had helped me a life where I have a small kid and a wife which saved my life. I am very very thankful to 
all the team members of Mr. Gokhale. Gokhale sir, especially who took it personally. I am very much happy that I have a great success.